Hello guys, I welcome you to my channel Laser Graphics and Multimedia. My name is Rafi Yakub. I'm reaching you live from Lagos State, Nigeria. And in this video, guys, I'm going to teach you how to uh, add multiple cards into your uh, WeChat Pay without any stress. All you have to do is to watch the step I'm taking in this video and see how you can actually add more than a single card for WeChat payment on WeChat, okay? But before we get to the practical started, if you are very new to this channel, don't forget to hit on the subscribe and click on the notification bell icon. So whenever I upload content about a WeChat tutorial or importation, you'll be able to get notified and watch the video. And lastly but not the least, if you would like me to procure your link on 1688, Tahoba or Pindodo, you can reach me via the phone number on the screen of this video. And also, if you want my one-on-one -on -one premium class on importation feel free to reach me via the same phone number on this uh, on the screen of this video let's just talk more about importation business only if you have interest okay so let's get to the practical started so like i said earlier guys i'm going to teach you how to add more than a single card into your wechat pay account okay so let's get started so as you can see here this is my wechat pay i mean wechat account so i'm going to click on it right away All right, so the next step you have to take is to uh, click on me. Then it, it open up this way. So the next step you have to take is to click on pay. Now it's open up this way. So the next thing you have to do is to click on wallet so when you click on wallet it open up this way next step you have to take is to click on cards boom at this point here you can see my current default card this is MasterCard has been already added to be, uh, before but now I want to add more cards to this account all you have to do is to click on add uh, bank card so uh, i'm going to click on it right away so when you click on it they're going to ask you to enter your payment password for false identification so once you enter your payment password you'll be taken to the next step whereby you need to enter your card information such as card number expire date and cvv three digits at the back of your card so once you are done then you click on ok so automatically your card will be added to the current one you have in your WeChat pay. I hope you guys learn one or two things in this video. If you enjoyed this video, give the video a big thumb up and also if you have any question as far as the tutorial is concerned, you can put your question in a comment section down below. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.